check this out. This is an awesome, awesome video. Background, whatever you want to call it. Look at this. This is just phenomenal. So if y'all guys, like I said, you want to check them out, want to get into this kind of a video setup and have like a really nice overlay of yourself on top of it, we're going to do this. It's going to be awesome. Check out my newer videos coming on FBC Virtual channel and also on fbc-virtual.com. And welcome to a waterfall. Really, really, really pretty waterfall, right? So what I'm doing, I'm trying to create differing background scenes and something that is going to inspire other people to try my YouTube channel. But not just to try my YouTube channel, to actually interact and choose to utilize it for beneficial purposes for them. Why do I do this? I want to help more people on the online world to pretty much discover the differing tools that are out there and be able to benefit from it. And that's what I do at my actual website, fpc-virtual.com. If y'all guys want to go to, to that location, I'll make sure I'll have tutorials on there and things like that for y'all folks to learn how to remove your background, use green screen, use a blue screen, how to use the OBS uh, platform, which is the open broadcaster software platform, and maybe XSplit if you want to do live streams, things like that. I pretty much, I'm getting really, really into this. On that website, you're gonna get all of my latest, my most latest, and they're gonna be organized and put into a really cool format. And then also you can join and learn a little bit more off of my network. So there you go. Look at that, that is just amazing. Look at the sun coming through and all of this stuff. I get this from a public domain location and I'm gonna be doing a reveal on that as well. Very soon. Is the audio quality a lot better? I'm sure it is, hopefully it is. And that's my aim, my goal is to upgrade and continue to make my actual videos far more better. And I've been working on this thing for almost three months. It's been at least two months and a half that I learned how to remove my background. So that's really the point of the whole virtual set. So let's go. We're using OBS, by the way. This is the open broadcaster software. Let's move over so y'all folks can see that. Different transition. Moved over to another actual visual. So this could be more for... A, a news program more like reaction news that I'm trying to do and I'm trying to reach many more viewers because why well I have an idea of what YouTube is all about and I think that I can bring a really really awesome message to the online world and the community abroad all across the world no matter where you go you can find really awesome communications awesome tools awesome knowledge stuff like that so that's what I'm trying to bring across to the online world and um, each one teach one type of thing you know you help me I help you we help each other I learned something from you you learn something from me and that's basically what I've learned since I was a kid you know what I'm saying and since being in school learning knowledge and gaining and acquiring skills as an actual adult as well applied skills and learned skills combined so let's see let's move over to another scene this is a different scene right here. This scene is actually going to be for iOS app, you know, different tutorials that I choose to offer up to the online world and community. So y'all folks can get used to this. I'm also going to try to put in a different spiel every now and then, maybe do something really cool. Um, bring in maybe a guest host from somewhere else, maybe another tutorial guide, uh, YouTube creator, how-to video type person, and feature their stuff as well. So that's really another part of it about YouTube you want to collaborate and help other people to grow and expand you know what I'm saying so that's that's another part of it let's go to this welcome folks I'm your host Mike Pugh of the FPC virtual channel there's a lot of things you can do um, make sure you work on your audio you work on your visual which is how you look a little bit to some degree because you want to look as best as you possibly can. You want to smile <laughs> every now and then, try to be more yourself, try to feel, feel the, the moment and be part of what you're creating, you know what I mean? Like, try to have some passion and fill that video void, that emptiness of the video with awesome experiences, things that you know, things that, things that you could do 
you know, your own knowledge, common knowledge, or knowledge that is out there that is sought after, that people are looking for. That's one of the things you can do as well as an actual YouTube creator, as an actual social media personality. You'll be surprised what kind of stuff people don't know and what they want to know from you. So let's go back to the final scene. This is my final scene just to end this actual more of a overview of my virtual set. How did I do this? How did I create it? Well, basically, you have to remove your background first and then once you remove your background using either a green screen or a blue screen then you're able to go a little bit further if you don't know how to use the chroma key setup on OBS I'll show y'all folks how to do that just comment in the bottom of the description area and let me know and y'all guys can contact me in different ways and I can get you the video or you can check out the rest of my videos that are soon to be released I'm making them as I go along so it's taking a little time I wanted to make sure that my audio was a lot better and my audio was the big issue, one of the main issues that really hurt my channel and why people nine times out of ten are not subscribing because they want to hear something that's of good quality and I had my PC running my my laptop PC was creating a lot of background noise because of overheating and it's hard to get rid of that problem so I figured it out, I finally figured it out and I'm using my Android phone to solve the problem so I'm using a Google Chrome Google Chrome remote desktop application and I'm putting it onto my actual Android device and then I got my laptop PC outside of this room. This is an actual sunroom where all the sunlight comes in and everything. What I did, I blocked out all of the light and now I'm only using one light above me which is the, the room lighting, right? And then I removed the background. So I cleared out as much errors and you know defects and how would you say you know any kind of slight inconsistencies as possible and this is what I came up with so that's what you want to try to do yourself as well with your virtual set if you're in your own bedroom and you want to make it look a lot better for maybe YouTube gaming or stuff like that definitely think about working it and working it and working it. even if it takes you six months it doesn't matter how long it takes for you to improve it but once you get that thing to the best possible quality as you can get it you're gonna start to get more viewers because people like higher quality obviously that's what makes or breaks a YouTube channel and your presence from being known or or not you know what I'm saying some people may be funnier some people may be not more knowledgeable than other people some people may have better eye, eye candy like have really nice body features or whatever that people like to look at or whatever the case may be those things shouldn't stop you or hinder you from trying to succeed because you can figure out your way up the success ladder no matter what you understand so that's one of the tips I want to give y'all folks out there who are starting out on YouTube or probably been using YouTube as a creator or a person who is interested in becoming a YouTube creator but you just don't see the motivation because motivation is driven by the fact that you wanna get results right so some people they get they get more motivation from seeing results some people get more motivation from not seeing results I'm the type of person who gets motivation from anything it doesn't matter what it is and I get inspired by a great deal of things so when I see something I try to act on it and when I hear something I try to react on it and that's basically my personality your personality may be a lot different so Think about that as well when you're trying to create this virtual experience you're trying to create a different presence using YouTube so hopefully those tips help if y'all folks like this video please do subscribe to my channel please do share it socially if you believe that it's going to impact other people and benefit other people because that's what YouTube is all about um, and also please do hit the thumbs up if you liked it and that's all I got Joe Love and Peace told Mike Pugh signing off, and I'll see you in the next tutorials. Peace. Welcome, folks. I'm your host, Mike Pugh of the FBC Virtual Channel. And what you're looking at is the sign-in location on Sue. And the reason why I brought you here, besides letting you know what the network is, I decided to give y'all guys a grand tour as to what Sue is about, how Sue works, and what Sue really is. SU, T-S-U, is a social network pretty much. 
and like Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, and all the So, yeah, it's tough. It is tough. It's not easy. I'm not going to lie. But it's definitely better than not doing anything at all. It's better than drawing blanks. So working on this virtual set, yo, is definitely worth it. So there you go. Peace.